Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about another problem that we got from 2013 Singapore Mass Olympiad. In this problem, we have a triangle ABC and we know DC is 2 times BD. We also know that angle D is 60 degrees and angle B is 45 degrees. We want to find angle C. Before moving forward to talk about the solution, make sure that you pause the video to think about the problem. To solve this problem, we are going to add two lines. First, in triangle ADC, we are going to connect C to AD using the height of the triangle. Let's name this CM. Then we connect B to M. Now let's focus on triangle CMD. In this right triangle, we have M1 is equal to 90 degrees. D1 is equal to 60 degrees. And as a result, C2 is going to be 30 degrees. Now in triangle CMD, C2 is 30 degrees. And we can write DC is twice. MD. Remember DC was twice BD as well. So MD and BD are going to be equal. Now let's focus on MDB triangle. In this triangle, first we know that D2 is equal to 120 degrees. Then we know BD and MD are equal. So M2 is equal to B1 is equal to 30 degrees. Remember B1 plus B2 was 45. Now we have 30 degrees for B1 and it results in 15 degrees for B2. Now in triangle BMC we know both angles B1 and C2 are 30 degrees. So we can see that CM is equal to BM. Now in triangle AMB we know B2 is equal to 15 degrees and we know M2 is equal to 30 degrees. So A2 is equal to 15 degrees as well. So in the same triangle A and B, we have two angles A2 and B2, both are equal. This results in AM is equal to BM. Let's move to the triangle AMC, which is a right triangle. In this right triangle, AM is equal to CM. So A1 and C1 are both 45 degrees. Now we have everything that we need to have. We know C1 is equal to 45 degrees and we know C2 is equal to 30 degrees. So angle C is equal to 75 degrees and that's our answer. To wrap up, let's summarize what we've done to solve this problem. In this problem, we knew the angles that we have for D and B and we wanted to find the angle that we have for C. We also knew DC is equal to 2 times BD. So we first connected C to AD using the height of the triangle ADC. And then we connected B to the point that the height crosses AD. Then we have four new triangles. We first started with the green triangle. We found all the angles. And then we moved to the red triangle. After that, we move to the blue triangle and at the end, we find the angles that we have for the purple triangle. Finally, using the angles that we have for the purple and green triangles, we found the answer. Thanks for watching the video. If you would like to see more puzzles and mass involved activities, please subscribe to the channel.